Everybody, are you seeing this? And this is what we were talking just yesterday in the live. This comes as an urgent video response to the short-term price of Shiba Inu. Why is Dogecoin, Bonk, Pepe, with Jasmine going down, including Shiba Inu? Let's focus on Shiba Inu right now because just yesterday, you know, I asked you, like, what do you want Shiba Inu to do? And most of us, we want pump, right? But if you're a trader, prepare because it looks like for what I start to see right now as a breakdown from the breaking point symmetrical wedge that we were following right now. Um, the, the trend that we're seeing on Shiba Inu is no longer in the short term bullish. If you open up, obviously it's bullish, but right now it's bearish a little bit. That's what I meant to say. Bitcoin just passed almost $73,000. It was $72,900. What it means is the liquidity is going to Bitcoin right now and kind of makes total sense. I'm just telling you what is happening, right? We just woke up. We got all the energy. We got also CPI information and it increased a little bit 3.2% headline. So, you know, not the greatest news and really doesn't really affect too much meme coins at this point, but just letting you know what's happening. The... The feeling is once at the 80s, no longer at the 90s, right? As we were last week, 10 days ago, Shiba Inu was ballooning, phenomenal. Right now, it's been consolidated. And what I'm seeing a lot is that correction. You know, people are now, well, from, you know, the influencers that I follow and the people that I follow too, um, I see most people saying correction, correction, correction. Now, it, will that happen for Shiba Inu? Well, let me show you. Pepe, 8% last 24 hours. With 8%. Bonk, 4%. Shiba Inu, 3%. It seems, guys, I'm, I just want to make sure you understand. I think we are early. It may seem that Shiba Inu is going to do 1-8% right now. He hasn't done it yet. So if you're a trader, not financial advice, I'm just letting you know what it, what's right here, right? If you're a trader... This wouldn't be a bad idea to take some profits out. I'm not going to do it because I honestly, it's fine for me. I just want to keep adding and adding and adding. But we could be seeing, look, now it's 5% down overall right here, right? I think we could be seeing 4029 once again. If that's the case, I got some monies, baby. I'm going to be, yesterday in the lab, we bought 500 bucks. Uh, so uh, obviously that that entry is, is down right now, but it's fine. Um, obviously, you don't put all your money in. Just start, you know, dollar cost averaging like I'm doing here. I bought here, 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 here. So I'm good on this one. Um, I mean, this is a consolidation level for Shiba Inu, everybody. And we're here. Could we go back to this level? If that's the case, it wouldn't be a bad idea for me to cash out some profits. And that's true. I could do that. I could do that, right? Should I? Don't forget to smash the like button, guys. Consider subscribing to the channel. Turn on those notification bells. Take a look at the first link down below. Our main sponsor here in the channel, Lux Algo, best crypto indicator, in my opinion, for, for TradingView. I use it because it really helps, especially, you know, to make these tough calls if you want to. Um, but... Finally, seeing guys that the market is, you know, led by led by Pepe, and I knew not by to not buy Pepe at these such high levels. Bonk is also, you know, coming down a little bit. Just have to understand that this was a nice rally for meme coins and community tokens. It doesn't mean it's over. It just means that for now the liquidity is going somewhere else. Corrections always happen. Uh, if we go to one day, you're gonna see the following. Like we're tracking the price of Shiba Inu, and you see it right here. Don't let you be misguided by the YouTube channels that have no face, no real name, just claiming that Shiba Inu is going to go to $10. I've seen them. Shibatic is one that I that I criticize a lot. I, I mean, nobody's, nobody's going to know who the person is, but they're claiming, a, you know, crazy and unreal, uh, unrealistic price predictions that are driving a lot of the retail money into the grown time. It's good to buy Shiba Inu, in my opinion, but you have to look at the data and see what, what the best time is. That's what I think the best way of approaching this could be. 
we rose all of this, finally stopping at 4045, I think it will make total sense to go back a few levels down and then start from there. Not saying that it's going to go back to 508. I don't think so. Uh, I mean, that level is well gone by now. But I can be wrong. That's one thing that I hope you, you get it from this video too. It's not that Chivino is going to come down and then go up. Chivino can stop dumping and then come back up and then crush it. That can happen as well. <laughs> Let me be perfectly clear because nobody knows what's going to happen, but I'm just telling you what my expectation is based. Let's go ahead and bring Bitcoin BTC. BTC right now got all the way to $72,960 while I was asleep. You know, happened early. People are claiming people are so happy and excited. Um, we got the inflation rate. We got, you know, Bannock removing all of the trading fees until the end of March because there's so much bullish momentum right now. You know, people are just crazy right now for Bitcoin, which makes total sense. Then why should we be risking too much on altcoins? Well, because when altcoins are not moving positively for us, when people are selling, that's basically why, because they're looking into Bitcoin and Ethereum. It is a good idea to pitch a little bit because eventually Shiba Inu is going to go to 301. That's a price analysis. That's what my target is and a little bit higher for my exit strategy. Uh, that's what I'm looking. You know what's happening eventually. So why risk it right now? Well, um, always good to add 150 million Shiba Inu I have and I want to keep adding for sure. It is now more than likely going to go lower than Avalanche. I'm pretty positive it's going to stay in position 11 for a while. So at 4032, at 4032, I can tell you how we are going down, you know, lower than Avalanche. We're going to have this separation. Dogecoin holding really nice and tidy, but you finally start to see what we expected after such a long ride of pushing the fall, the come down price that I think a lot of whales were expecting to come in once again. Our job is to find that support level to know where. And from now, we go back to Shiba Inu once again, just to give you an idea. I call this like a breaking point right yesterday. And it seems that it's looking like a breakdown from, from what I see. Uh, we have the first level right here at uh, 4021. 4029 is right here, but we don't really have so much consolidation. We have some, you know, stops. So we'll see how far and how hard Chivino drops. This is what we could be seeing like, which is, is it 2030? 30. 30. So it makes sense. It makes sense if we do that. Um, just preparing you before the nastiness comes and we'll be live and we'll be talking, right? But don't worry that. You know, it's all going to go back to the price. No, 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 no. It's just a little correction, which makes sense. And then we come back up. That's my expectations. Let me know what you think, guys. Smash the like button. Now you're aware of what I'm thinking. And I obviously got the money to come in and continue and continue. Because at the end of the day, when we pass all the time, we won't even care about these levels right now. Peace.